I'm going to show you some more insights that comes from our insight program. But this insight will be focusing specifically on what software is in decline amongst this category of change aware small firms, what software categories are in the ascendance, and then specifically looking at the bookkeeping engine, looking at practice management software, looking at forecasting and planning software, and looking at payroll software, and looking at data and expense management software. Yeah, so we we probably weren't the very the very first wave of adoption of Elite in that I was out working in practice when zero except the launch. So we, we were on the sort of second cusp of it, I guess. Um, and we've done, when we started out, we, so we did zero rollout plus a few key apps. Um, but I think we're at the stage now where we've seen like a lot of things that I thought would have happened by now haven't, they sort of faltered. Um, so the obvious things work like Dex and, you know, Chaser and things like, all these things that fix problems do work, but there's like a lot of what I would call nice to have apps. We've put a lot of time and resource to try and get them to work and they the haven't. So we've really, in fact, the bridge, we still bridge a few things with Excel spreadsheets and things like that for reporting. Um, so that's where we are. And I think as well, I think, I think the next, I think the next round of tech that's coming out is obviously does present a few opportunities for for accountants who maybe don't want to go down this virtual FD route but want to do sort of extended bookkeeping services, things like, you know, there's some good apps coming out for payment services um, and like the open bank and stuff, so that presents quite a good opportunity for enhanced bookkeeping and financial controls and, and purchase ledger management, etc.